Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Crystal and in today's video I want to talk about the importance of strength training and why it's so good for your hormone health. So in this video I'll be talking about the five reasons why I think strength training is pretty amazing and I know that I don't look like I strength train. I have long muscles, okay, but I love strength training. It is my favorite way to work out and I didn't always feel that way about it. It wasn't until probably about five or six years ago that I started to actually lift some weights <laughs> and I'm not talking about like lifting as heavy as possible or anything like that, but I'm just talking about going into the weight room and picking up a dumbbell and being like, oh, okay, I, I think I can do this because up until I was like in my mid 20s I didn't touch a weight at all. I was so scared of going into the weight room. I didn't want to get bulky. I didn't want to look like manly. And uh, to be completely honest, it was just really intimidating. But strength training has so many benefits, especially for hormone health. And you don't have to go like as heavy as possible. You don't have to do anything crazy like that. Even body weight movements like calisthenics are a form of strength training. So that's like push-ups and pull-ups and that kind of thing. There's also TRX training. There's resistance bands. Like all of these things build strength and that is what strength training is And so I just wanted to talk about it because I'm really passionate about it And I think it can be really beneficial for everyone and really beneficial for our hormones So the first reason why I think strength training is so amazing is because it can actually help balance estrogen levels And this happens for a lot of different reasons I mean when you're working out you're sweating and sweating is a great detox pathway and also when you work out um, It kind of helps keep you regular. <laughs> it's really Really great to move your body because it helps your digestion and keeping regular is actually one of the best ways to keep your hormones in check because when you go to the bathroom you're actually excreting excess hormones and another reason why and probably the biggest reason why you can balance your estrogen levels by strength training is because strength training helps you build muscle and so this ties into my next reason why strength training is really amazing is because it helps you build muscle which not only boosts your metabolism but also helps you reduce fat on your body. I'm not here to tell you that you need to be the leanest body fat ever. I am not a fan of that. You guys know I'm a fan of intuitive movement, listening to your body, not being excessive with your exercise. Um, but there is something to be said about building muscle. It is really important. And when you build muscle and change your body competition to have more muscle and reduce a little bit of the fat you have on your body, that can be really helpful because fat actually can create estrogen. Like it is an estrogen factory. And I think a lot of us think that like the body fat we have on our bodies just is inert it doesn't really do anything but it does and so the more body fat that you do have on your body the more uh, it can produce estrogen and throw your levels out of whack so this is why having a healthy body fat percentage is really important for hormone balance because then you're not kind of like fighting against anything you're not fighting kind of like an uphill battle the other thing too is obviously if you have too much it can produce lots of estrogen things can get a little bit crazy but if you have like a really low body fat percentage you might not actually produce enough estrogen and that can cause a lot of issues as well. So that's why you wanna find your sweet spot because being on either end of the spectrum, uh, things can get a little crazy. So strength training not only helps you build muscle, but it also helps you boost your metabolism, burn a little bit of fat and also boost your confidence. I know when I started to weight lift, I started to feel so much more confident in myself and it's just um, another added bonus because if you feel strong and confident, that's gonna translate into all different areas of your life. Now my third reason why I think strength training is super important is that it helps increase insulin sensitivity. If your insulin levels are out of whack and you are progressing more towards a state of insulin resistance, that is going to throw your body through a loop. Insulin is a very, very important hormone, but too much insulin can actually cause things to get a little bit crazy. And what I mean by that is that insulin can actually create like an excess of cortisol in your body. It can also affect your progesterone levels and it can also increase testosterone. And so if you're someone that is struggling with like an insulin resistant condition like diabetes or PCOS. Thankfully, strength training has been shown to improve insulin sensitivity, which is super important uh, for all of us because as we age, things can shift in our bodies. As we change our diets or our lifestyle, things can shift. And so strength training is just a really great way of just like keeping those insulin levels in check. Now my fourth reason why I think strength training is super important doesn't really have to do with hormones, but it's too important not to talk about. And that is that strength training helps you build better bone density and actually decrease your risk of osteoporosis. 
and that's important because as we age our bones lose density like that is just a thing that happens and especially with women and menstruators it's just something that we have to be really conscious of like our bone mass gets weaker as we age and that can put us at risk for injury fractures all that kind of thing strength training is a great way of building that bone density and increasing your peak bone mass and so that's why it's really important to incorporate strength training like throughout your life a lot of people will start strength training later in life because they do have these bone issues so if you start strength training earlier in life like i did you know like in my mid-20s then that is going to kind of give you a bit of an edge because you are going to be building up your bone density and you're going to have a lot more peak bone mass so you're not going to be um, as at risk for losing <laughs> it as you get older so that's just another benefit of strength training that's just like way too important it's been shown that even people that have issues with osteoporosis and stuff like that as soon as they start strength training and adding that into the routine their bones start doing a lot better so if we can get like ahead of ourselves i think that's really important and now on to my fifth and final reason why i think strength training is so important and that is because strength training helps boost your mood and helps reduce your risk of depression, which is amazing in itself. And that is the reason why I continue to strength train. I mean, strength training, sometimes it can be a hard challenge on your body, you know, strength training. It's not an easy way to work out for sure. Like you are challenging yourself, but I find that the mental health benefits are so profound. And that is why I've stuck through it throughout the years. I find that if you're gonna strength train for aesthetic purposes, that's great. Like, you know, who doesn't wanna build muscle or build a booty or get bolder shoulders? Like who doesn't want that? But sometimes those goals can only take you so far. And it's really important to have like long-term commitments and goals when it comes to like exercise and stuff. And that is what has happened with me. Um, I first started working out for aesthetic goals, but then I realized how good it made my mental health feel. It helps me so, so much. And strength training is really great as well because it does help decrease stress, which is a really great benefit. And the other really great benefit is that it can help improve your sleep. So all of these things are going to help improve your mood. Exercise is usually the first line of treatment for people that are struggling with uh, PMS or hormone issues or even mental health issues. And there's a reason for that. It's not because <laughs> your doctor wants you to suffer through like, you know, an hour workout every day. It's because there are real tangible benefits to moving your body. And if strength training isn't for you, then that's fine. I know that this video is about strength training, but just moving your body in a way that you love is important. It's going to help you so much. Strength training is how I love to move my body and I'm really passionate about it. I know that's not everyone's thing, but find something you're passionate about, move your body, get your heart rate up, and that is gonna give you so many benefits. It's gonna give you so many benefits for your mood as well. And that is why exercise is such an important part of our lives and it's really important to find something that you love to do so you can continue doing it and find the joy in it. So that's my five reasons why I think I think strength training is so amazing. I hope you guys liked this video. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. I really appreciate you guys watching and commenting. It means a lot to me. And as always, your cycle matters so much and I'm here for you. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.